Okay. Let's begin. Greetings survivors, I am the last man on earth, and if you don't like that intro, too bad, because I'm sticking with it. I have an important message to tell you. On August 25th, I will no longer be residing in this room anymore. No, instead I'm going to be uh, moving up north because, yeah, I'm, I'm going to college there. And shopping for college has been a hassle to say the least. I mean, just look at all of this stuff that I have just waiting to be packed up and going. And look, like this is just a wall blocking everything else. There is everything else. Just look at all of that stuff and that's not even half of it. There's like, there's like some hangers in there. It's very hard to see. And in this box, there's like a mattress. There's like bed sheets and pillows and comforters and stuff like that. And I haven't even, I haven't even gotten to the official documents and the stuff that I ordered online. So, yeah. But on the bright side, in lieu of all that shopping, I managed to get a new uh, laptop. So, yeah. It's, it's kind of nice. This laptop has an awesome layout that I can make sleek and all sorts of things. Is that a music editing software? Oh my god, it is! And I'm already working on a project that may or may not take months to complete? And it's not only cheaper than a MacBook, but it's also better technologically wise in every single way possible, except for cosmetics because you know, I truly care about the cosmetics of my laptop. Well, sign me up, Microsoft, because you just made me forget that your primary search engine is Bing, and your primary search and your primary, uh, well, browser is Internet Explorer. Yay! Oh yeah, and your constant updates that take forever. But that's not the main reason why I made this video. Um. If the people who I think are watching are actually watching this video, then I really want you people to, like, share this video with as many people as you possibly can. And more likely than not, they're probably going to be people that I know from my school and people that I personally know because, you know, at this stage, only people I personally know are watching my videos. But I need you to share this video with them because I have something important to tell them. I want to speak to you directly and just thank you guys so much for all that you have done for me, all that you've done for the past four years of my high school life. I, I just want to say I'm truly thankful and truly happy that you guys were just yourselves around me and you gave me such a really positive outlook on the way the world is right now. Now I stated this before in my uh, last video that wasn't an update and wasn't me getting kidnapped. Um, I, I truly believe that as of right now, high school has been one of the greatest times of my life and until college is completely done, that opinion is going to stay with me for the rest of my life. And I'm truly thankful that because it's been so good, I've been able to have such a positive outlook on not only how I've changed as a person, but also you know, the people around me that have changed me. Like, there have been so many people that I met in high school and I can, I can remember so many of them by name that it's, it's just incredible. That's how much of a lasting impression they have put on me. The amount of kindness that you guys have showered upon me, it's just so unbelievable and I'm really thankful for it. Like, like for example, um, uh, during graduation, I was one of the speakers. I was one of the graduation speakers, along with two other people who were um, debate, who were uh, professional debaters. They were professional speakers. They really loved to make speeches and, and debate with people. And because of that, I was really nervous that um, my speech was going to be like, completely awful. But to my surprise, 
after after the graduation and even like weeks after I had gotten my diploma, you know, people were showering praise upon me, saying how amazing my speech was, how genuine it was, and and some even went as far as to say it was like one of the best speeches they heard in their life, and that's really incredible. That's that's amazing. I and I'm I'm truly thankful for it. I I truly am really thankful for it. In fact, you guys were like so supportive of my speech that it actually convinced me, you know what? I feel like I want to do more of that. I feel like I really want to do more of that. In fact, I got my college schedule here and in one of the slots, look, public speaking right there. I don't just want to thank the people that were supportive of my speech. I also want to thank uh, everybody who was supportive of me during m my classes, my school time, my extracurriculars, all of that. Like, <clears throat> my extracurriculars are the main reason why I enjoy high school so much. I mean, the classes were great, the teachers were very awesome, they were really nice, they were really supportive, they really wanted to help me. The, my classmates were also really cool, really understanding, and, and they made me question my own intelligence because of how s intelligent they were. But the extracurriculars, they, those kinds of people in the extracurriculars, I just looked at them and thought, oh my god, these people are amazing. When I was a little kid, um, the people that I mostly looked up to and saw as just people who knew exactly what they were doing and people who had everything ready to go, just they were good at everything. I, those kinds of people were like much, much older than me and much taller than me. It, it was just, it was just like looking at a god, except he wasn't a god, he was a mortal. Like a mortal god, a demigod. I felt like I was looking at a demigod when I was a little kid. And now that I'm in high school, now that I actually at the status that I previously thought those demigods were at, the people that I look to for inspiration have fallen into two categories. The first category are people significantly older than me, like people in their 20s, 30s, 40s. I still look up to people that are much older than me, but the other half, it's filled with so many people who are significantly younger than me, even the same age as me, and I look at them and I think, wow, this this is amazing. Like, the amount of talent and intelligence and just incredible behavior in you, it's just, your maturity is, oh, I can't even find the correct words for it. It's so amazing. I'm so sorry if this video has just turned into me like blubbering like an idiot. Just, I'm just spilling my feelings out towards all of you. I'm, I want to be as genuine as possible when I say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for making the last four years of my life probably the most enjoyable I have experienced so far. It's been so incredible. It's, and there I go, repeating words again like an idiot. Okay, I'm gonna wrap this up right now, so I, Bottom line, I just want to say thank you all so much for being so intelligent, so incredible, so inspiring, so, so talented, and thank you so much for impacting my life the way you have. And I really want to say what you guys have, it truly is something special. Don't let it go to waste under any circumstances. I really, I really am thankful for how you have impacted my life. How much positivity has been spread the past four years. How much, you're, how much you mean to me. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. Well. Now that I'm done blubbering my feelings out in front of a camera,
probably embarrassing myself in front of the entire internet. Well, I just want to say, again, thank you, and I'll see what the future holds. Bye.